So men talk a lot about um, accountability and choosing better. Cool. So I want us to continue to speak on things where we might make pitfalls. I'm not sure if we've all heard of future faking, but we know what it is. But what future faking is, and this is a strategy that narcissists use with love bombing. So this goes hand in hand. Uses inferences that suggest you'll have a future together. Outwardly suggests that you have a future together, although you barely know this person. That's why I said it goes hand in hand with love bombing. Makes promises about the future, yet take no action to make those promises happen. Like talking about dating, talking about long-term commitment, yet still haven't actually made the commitment to go for it. Talk about the cute kids you'll have one day and the great holidays you'll take next year without any real intention or actions to make those things happen. Talk about the future they think you want so that they can take advantage of you in the moment. Narcissists use this power of possible awesome of a possible awesome future to keep you hooked as form of a narcissistic supply now. So how does that play into everyday life? You know, when we are in the initial stages, those heightened butterflies and that love or what we might feel as love can be overwhelming. And people who are playing games, homosexuals, ashes, people that are playing games, hustlers, hospice hustlers, <laughs> they will use future faking to hook you in. And you need to know the signs. So I found this article about future faking. Once again, future faking is when someone uses a detailed vision of the future to facilitate the bonding and connection in a romantic relationship. It's their way of getting your attention and your admiration. That should not be enough to continue um, a conversation or a commitment or attempt a relationship with somebody. I just want to put this in the atmosphere so that we are aware when it happens. So you'll be like, ding, 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 I've heard that term or I've seen this. This is a great point right here. If you're on the receiving end of future faking, you can suffer emotionally because even if it's not intentional, the result is that the relationship tends to blow up in painful ways. When people are promising, 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 and you actually believe them, then it hurt. It hurts. Um, that is why when people talk about choose better, it's disingenuous because some of these people are promising things and then they don't come through. How are you supposed to know they're hustling you? They might not even know they're hustling you. They might not know that they're not going to follow through. Anyways, you guys like, comment, and share.